Well, when we get a little older, life seems to slow down a bit, but not for the Golden Girls of Padre Lakes in St. George. These gals are on a tear. Yeah, these lovely, amazing angels are weaving a little love for a number of needy charities in their community. Tonight, we travel to St. George to pay it forward. I'm Mark, Mark Cabell with Channel 2. Oh. I'm here in St. George to meet Evelyn Scott and all of her friends at the Padre Lakes Retirement Community. Well, you're better looking in person than you are on TV. I am to give you a big hug. Oh. <laughs> These amazing women make everything from clothing to hats, toys, and beautiful quilts. And while they're creating, they're also doing a little healing. And a lot of us have lost a spouse, either a wife or a husband. This is this organization has really helped us get past that. So a little bit of, you can do a little bit of everything, don't you? All of these items are beautiful enough to become family heirlooms, all made with patience and love. And we did 1,475 items. But some might be a little hard to part with. And these hats were made by Arlene Hatch, who passed away during the summer. Oh. And she spent her last days making. You're kidding? Me. No. Everything made here at Padre Lakes goes to charity, the Children's Learning Center, hospitals, women's shelters, and several volunteer programs. And I love doing it because I, I want to give back. I'm Some of the men get involved too. In fact, Evelyn's brother sets up all the tables and quilting stands. Sometimes they even stitch a thing or two. Children, are you pretty good with the needle? Uh, not as good as he is. <laughs> really? I do the hard work. Sure, yeah. <laughs> is it fun to get together like this? Oh yes, we have more fun visiting. I bet there's some stories that are told around the old quilt thing. <laughs> you notice we keep the men over there in the corner. They've been doing this for six years, but it's not always easy finding supplies. Where do you get all your cloth? It's donated. Or, it? Yeah. yeah. We might be able to help the folks at Padre Lakes spread a little bit more love. It's time to pay it forward with Sterling Nielsen from Mountain America Credit Union. We are, I'm so impressed with what you're doing here. This is amazing. All this hard work and we'd like to help out. We'd like to make sure you have enough supplies for the next oh year. Oh my gosh. I have this envelope, 500 additional dollars. Oh! I got a scarf. Oh, they're so happy. I got a scarf out of the deal. I don't know oh, if you good. saw it. Yeah, it was great. Uh -uh, I didn't see. Well, even though Evelyn and her gang are in the Padre Lakes community just outside St. George, they welcome anybody in the area to come down and participate if they'd like to help out. They also welcome any donations of cloth or quilting supplies. When they got the donation, their expressions were priceless. <laughs> they were happy. <laughs> if you know someone paying it forward to the community, tell us about them, and Mark may show up with $500 for them. You can nominate them at KUTV.com. Just click on Pay It Forward.